Jules, here we are, getting to the, the final game of the, the regular season. What's the mood in there? Yeah, look, there's a confident bunch of boys in the, in the changing rooms at the moment. We had a good result on the weekend against Northampton. It's all about uh, making sure we continue on that pathway and we put in a good performance at Gloucester this weekend. Two very good performances in the last couple of weeks, so maybe hitting the, the top form at the right time. Yeah, you want to try and hit form at this time of the year, um, and we're doing that. Um, again, it's about continuing that, uh, not taking the foot off now, making sure that we keep driving the standards and we keep performing the way we have been. How important is it that there is still something to play for in this match that means you keep up that intensity? It's, it's vital, I think. Again, you don't want to go into this last game with nothing really to play for. You want to be trying to fight uh, to, to, win, to win the top of the table, I suppose, uh, and get, a, and get a, a home semi-final. That's the big thing for us, is making sure that we uh, get that result. What would a home semi-final mean? Well, we look back to, I suppose, last year and just, I suppose, the, the support you get from all the fans and the guys that come here, the way the uh, crowd gets behind you, the way the boys react to that. Um, they're, they're massive occasions if you want to be a part of that. Because I guess on Saturday, this might, that might have been the last game here, but you don't want it to be, do you? No, not at all. It's, it's all about uh, demanding the best from the guys and making sure that we, we get that home semi-final. How do you focus on Gloucester then? Because they've got things to play for as well, so they're not going to be there to roll over, are they? No, it's a tough place to go. Um, you always get a good reaction from the shed there, and uh, it's one of those games that we've got to make sure that we're, we're up for. Um, and we want to be making sure that, again, we just continue on, on the pathway that we are at the moment. What message has Rob and the other coaches been getting across to you since you've come back after Saturday? Well, for us, it's just looking internally and just making sure that we're on song, that we're demanding the performance that we know we can put out there and uh, making sure that we don't look too far ahead. It's just about putting game on game and making sure that uh, we continue those, those ways. It's obviously been a, a long, tough, hard season, but how much are you having to dig into those reserves now as we get to this stage? Yeah, well, injuries come and go. Um, you know, guys filtering in, filtering out, and you rely on the depth of squad. And thankfully, we've got a lot of depth here. We've got a lot of talented players. So sometimes you lose a guy, but then you bring in someone that's equally talented. And uh, we've had to dig into that to some extent. Uh, we've got a few guys coming back. We've got a few guys who are going to be missed. Um, but again, that's part and parcel of the of the rugby season. We look forward to guys coming in and getting an opportunity. Um, and we've seen throughout the year that the guys that have come in have definitely stood, stood up. And nobody wants to miss out at that stage where the, the prize so close, do they? No, it's, it's all there for the taking, isn't it? Uh, and if we continue on the ways that we are at the moment, then it's all to play for. What do you think will happen at Gloucester? Can you keep this amazing run of bonus points going? I hope so. That's the plan anyways. Again, we pride ourselves on throwing the ball around. Uh, scoring tries and equally being sound in defence. So again, it's just about making sure that we keep that momentum going. Jules, go back to, to 12 months ago, what lessons have been learned and how much of a different side are you now to, to the side that perhaps was in the semi-final against Wasps last year? Yeah, look, uh, I suppose uh, we were confident last year, we're confident this year. Um, we've got a bit more depth this year, so we can rely on guys or losing a few guys and other guys stepping in. Obviously, you don't want to lose anyone at this stage of the year. Um, but we've got great depth there. The guys, yeah, are better for having experienced the semi final and the final. They know what it's about now. Uh, the confidence there, the belief is there. It's just making sure that we buy into that now. And obviously, uh, like you say, the, the depth has been shown, but when you get your jersey now, you, you're desperate to hang on to it, aren't you? Yeah, you never want to be left out of the team. And, and again, when you're given that opportunity, you want to take it with both hands and you don't want to, uh, you want to, don't want to release it. So it's about uh, putting on the, a performance that the, the jersey deserves and, and trying to hold on to it. And have the last two performances set benchmarks in terms of what can be achieved this season? They were two big, big performances. Yeah, again, going to Quinn's away and winning there was, was was big for the team. It's never an easy place to go. And then, likewise, Northampton here. I mean, they're a big, strong forward pack and they've got a good backline. And to be able to put in those performances and, and win by a good margin bodes well for the team.